shit. It's been almost a year since I arrived in Japan. I've been going all out, like literally going out and exploring Japan. It is amazing over here. There are so many things to do and buy. My wallet's pretty much throwing up cash at that point. Don't worry, I brought a couple of stuff with me, like my clothes, my camera gear, my Nintendo Switch. Speaking of that, there were some thoughts that came into mind. Like what would happen if I buy a Japanese game with my Nintendo Switch? The Nintendo Switch is region free so that means you could play Switch games from different countries, right? So I'm gonna go out and buy a couple Japanese games to see if you can play them on your Switch. So after going to the store, I got three games. I got Mario Odyssey, Sword Art Online, and... Oh yeah. So these are the three games I'm going to be checking out on the Nintendo Switch. And to see if they can actually be playable or not. Okay. Let's get to it. First, we'll take a look at Mario Odyssey. All right, so far so good. Yep, it is playable in English. So I have played the game prior to making this video and it's Mario Odyssey, all right? All of it's translated, so let's just move on to the next game. Next game will be Sora Online. Well, you can see right off the bat that there's three different languages to choose from. Chinese, Japanese, and Korean. So you can basically choose your own avatar. That's cool though. Sora Online is based off of an anime show called, of course, Sora Online. And it's about people being trapped in this VR world, which I enjoyed watching. It's like the show, it's one of those action RPGs. I didn't go too far into this, but either way, you can still play it. Now we'll take over th this game, I guess. I can't read any of these stuff, so I'm gonna have to half-fast this. Okay, this is a pretty long intro, and I don't know what the story is about. Oh my god, this video is gonna get me demonetized. This game is a spin-off of Senren Kajura, as it says here in Japanese. And it is a video game series exclusive to here in Japan. So this is a pinball game with silly perverted content and it's really crazy. Casually I'm going through the game and the majority of the time it's just Titty Avenue. I mean, look at this. The intro has a lot going on and the bonus games are just nuts. I only played through one game and this level just escalates through the roof. Well, it is playable, so I'll give it that. So, can you play Japanese games on your American Switch? Yeah. But there are only certain games that are region locked. Even though Nintendo said that the Nintendo Switch is region free, doesn't mean the games are too. It's like bringing a Japanese Super Mario 64 and bringing it back to the States and playing it on your American Japanese Switch. All of it's going to be in Japanese. But, there are some games that can be translated to English though. For example, all the Mario Bros games can be translated to English. As you saw from the Super Mario Odyssey clip, 
Pokemon games, of course, can be translated to English too. Then here's what you call imports, like Okami Remastered. You can get that in the eShop and play in English, but their physical copies are here in Japan. Takuno Tatsujin, which is an arcade rhythm game, and I can't believe I'm saying this, but Gal Gun 2 is another one. Can't believe I mentioned that. So if you want to buy an imported game, just see what games are playable in English. Lucky enough, I did end up buying the Sword Art Online game in English with this is the European version. And I stumbled across buying this one too. So I was like, eh, why not? Oh, hey, what's up, YouTube? I should really, like, clean up the desk. <sighs> Yeah, it's good enough. So of course, it's been a while since I uploaded another video and like over a year ago, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But you guys already know what's going around the world right now. The COVID-19 virus is spreading around and everybody's quarantined to their houses or rooms. That's why I'm able to upload this video since I can't go anywhere off base right now since I'm, I have to stick in base. But if you like this content, please subscribe down below and also give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down what you think about this video. Anyways, I'll catch you guys in the next one.